welcome back to my channel for those who are new welcome my name is Sarah and welcome to my channel Sarah's Life of Five. in today's video I would like to share with you guys my top five baby registry must have under 50 bucks so stay tuned if you like this video at the end of this video please remember to give me a big thumbs up remember to subscribe enjoy my channel and the most important click the notification bells it will let you know when i upload the next video the first item for those who are planning to breastfeed this is my first item i recommend for you guys and it's a must for me it's called a haka it looks like this it comes in this box this is a hundred percent silicone breast pump for those who are breastfeeding let's say you're breastfeeding the baby on this side you know sometimes when you're breastfeeding you leak from the other side and what happens you either have to get something to dry it to clean yourself while the baby's still you know eating on this side and you're wasting up that that side so what you do is since this is silicone you suction the other side and you let the baby eat on this side and it'll collect the milk and remember breast milk could last you know like room temperature for a while so what you do is you collect that milk you just leave it here it sucks like it sucks your room leave it there while you're breastfeeding the baby and then you can switch sides put the baby here and you do the same thing and by the end of both feedings you have up to probably up to four ounces it comes in this cardboard box this is a product from New Zealand I believe and then it has this brochure which I'm not going to zoom in the picture because it's very graphic I don't want to have problems here with copyright or with YouTube it explains to you and I show you a picture here and then it just comes in here and it comes wrapped with this paper that just says Huck. I bought this from Amazon I'm pretty sure they might sell it in other places and they have a different like a few different types of Huck up this is the regular one um, they also have another one that has a suction on the bottom and a suction like it has something in the, in the top and then there's another one that has a flower for just in case they get tipped over um, you know the flower holds it but I just got this one because nobody none of the other kids and nobody touches the haka only me it's kind of wet because I just washed it I ordered this one from Amazon and I believe it was around 12 to 15 dollars so this is a must have well, at least for me or if you're breastfeeding like I am okay number two sorry I'm standing up I have everything there in the bathroom number two I know some of you ladies are probably thinking oh my god that's a waste of money or you might not need this but if you're breastfeeding like me this is a must-have this is a bottle warmer um, since I'm breastfeeding you know in the middle of the night I have to go in the fridge or in the freezer and get the bottles might be cold or if it's breast milk and I don't have in the fridge um, it, it's frozen in the storage and the little breast storaging bags is frozen so this is a must-have for me you connect it to the outlet and this is a tummy tippy tummy tippy tummy tippy you put water you connect it and then the water here it boils the bottle and it, it heats up the bottle I think in from one to three minutes depending on how cold or the temperature of the bottle and these are the types of settings you see you put it here and it says number two and number three I always put it on number three which is it heats it up really fast so this is a must-have and this is another item on my list and it's under 50 bucks this was for around 18 to 20 bucks and to me it is a must-have Okay, item number three it's this lovely aqua the first year's bathtub this is a bathtub it says from newborn to 25 pounds here it says newborn and here it says from infant to toddler and what I like about this bathtub is you put the baby here and if you have a baby like mine he loves taking a bath you put him here and then what he does is he moves his feet and he tries to splash it on both sides this is the newborn stage he's almost two months so he's still in the newborn stage we still use this but after once he starts moving or sitting up by himself you remove this let's see if i can remove it oh yeah it's okay 
And then you see here, it has this comfortable thing. And it is not hard, it's very soft at all. Very super soft. And then when he's even bigger, he sits here on this side. You see? And what I like about it, let me flip it again. It has this little fishy thing. See the little fishy? And that's to put all the water and all the soap. And then after baby's done, you open it and you drain all the water. And what I like to do is I hang it in my bathroom after we're done and it dries completely. You can see, this is his washcloth, oh, it's dry. This bathtub, it's another item under 50 bucks and it's a must have because there's so many bathtubs. I wanted it to buy, which I, it's still in my baby registry. I wanted it to buy the, um, I think it's like a, like a flower thing that goes like in the sink or something but it was so complicated because I have a couple of friends of mine that they were bathing the baby and the baby's like this squish with the flower thingy going like that I'm um, like that flower thing is so pretty and so expensive it has no type of support you know you have to hold the baby and hold the, f the flower thing is like I don't know I just rather you know my baby's safe there he doesn't fall I could just lay him down there and then next to him and he's very comfortable so I really like this bathtub. It's not complicated, you know, you don't have to assemble any pieces. It came like that from Amazon in one piece. All you had to do, this came in a plastic thing and it came all together. You just clip it on the four corners and you're good to go. No complicated, you don't have to put parts or anything. When I was pregnant with my daughter, I remember I got a pretty bathtub that had like a little like a little handle here you had to attach it and then you had to attach it to the shower so when i was bathing her like the flower it was kind of like a sprinkler oh my god it was cute but it was oh, such a pain to take her shower and do all that so just don't complicate yourself ladies and just get you a buff tie like this and like i said it's up to 25 pounds so it's gonna last you a while next item item number four it's a must have, it's a boppy pillow. I know some of you ladies recommend a boppy lounge, but what I don't like about the lounge is you can use it for breastfeeding. And since I'm still breastfeeding, what I do is, by the way, it doesn't come like this. I bought this cover. The original one, let me open it. Let me share with you guys. Where's the zipper? Okay. The original is some gray clouds. See, that's it. There's a whole bunch of cute covers, but that's the cover that I bought. It matches his his crib, the sheets of his crib. Well, anyways, what I like about this bobby pillow, you put it around here, around your waist, and you could support the baby and, it, and support your elbows when you're holding the baby, both elbows, and it's easy to breastfeed. When I, since I was a C-section when I was in a hospital, I told hubby to take this one because I was alone with the baby and after a C-section, some of you ladies might know, it's very hard. You can't cough, it hurts to get up. So when they gave you the baby, I had this and it was easier for me to, you know, instead of getting up because I was scared my stitches were not open, you know, they'll just give me the baby and I'll put the baby here and it was so much easier for me for the first week of my c-section thanks to this pillow until today i still use it i'm still breastfeeding and i just put the baby like i i close it and he lays down like it was like it was a bobby lounge same thing i really like it and what i like about it you know the cover it's washable it doesn't get dirty and if baby spits on it whatever you just take the cover off and the cover stretches you put it in the washing machine and you put it again that's it the poppy pillow it depends because some of the popping pillow it depends on the color like on target they're around 30 40 bucks on bye bye baby they're around 35 yeah the one i'm gonna link down below i think is around 32 35 and amazon it varies because some of them already comes with a different pattern and it varies from 30 35 um, I've seen it in Ross in Burlington for 22 23 and all you have to do is buy the additional cover which the cover is like 10 12 dollars if you go to Amazon you just pick covers like this one it was like 15 dollars so it just depends but it's under 50 bucks 
and it's really worth it in my case especially if you're breastfeeding so i really give it a double thumbs up if you ladies are looking for a product that will help you breastfeeding i recommend that and the last item ladies number five i'll save the best for last it's where my baby sleeps for now this is where my baby sleeps it's portable it has a little velcro here and ta -da! Wait, hold on. this is where he sleeps he sleeps in between me and hubby for now okay. baby sleeps here it comes with a pad I just have this under it okay. it comes like that and it has a zipper the zipper goes all the way here and here and it washes you put the velcro again and it has a little handle and you could take it let's say you're in the living room watching tv and you want to put the baby to sleep you take this and you put it next to you in the couch or you could put it on the floor like on a rug of course this on the floor or if you're doing your hair and the baby's there the baby's secure here I really like this. This is called the Snuggle Delight or the Snuggle Nest. I'll leave the name up here because there's different types of this. There's another one that is like a up, upper grader, like a better model than this that has that has here. It has a light. This one doesn't have a light. I was looking for that one, but I couldn't find it. It has a light and it has like little buttons or something for like music and stuff. They have that one, but I think that one's a little bit pricier. And they had another one which was gray with clouds. They had a pink one. I just got this one that says love. It's all white and love, like very neutral for both boys and girls. I got this one for I'll say 40 bucks. But it you know it kind of varies. So if you have a baby registry, put this on your baby registry and use your discount coupon in Baba Baby or Target. If you use it in Baba Baby, remember Baba Baby gives you 20% off plus an additional 15, I believe. So you could get this super cheap for under 50 bucks if it's not already 50 bucks. Sometimes it's on clearance. If same thing for Target. Target when you do your baby registry in the little um, goodie bag, I'm a video for you. It came with a little booklet, and in that little booklet, it had 15% off for any item of this brand. So if you use that percent and you use your other 15%, um, your baby registry, I think it's called completion discount, you're saving 30% off this item. It might not be much to you guys, have the Target 5% credit card or debit card. That's an additional 5%. You ladies, you receive my receive target gift cards i know a lot of you ladies are planning to do baby showers i didn't have a baby shower but i know some of you ladies might be gifted gift cards to use those gift cards along with your discount and you could get this for under 50 bucks if it's not 50 bucks this is the must is the must also for ladies of you ladies for first moms for those of you ladies who don't have space for a crib and are thinking about a bath and air or things like that I had a c-section that's the reason I got this one this was my fifth c-section and I couldn't be getting up laying down getting up and I have other kids to attend so this was a must-have for me because of my c-section my fifth c-section and it took me longer to heal so this was a must for me the must for me must for me for me to be like like the big nice crying and I run you know he's next to me instead of getting up and you know trying to get her I was trying to prevent all that so this was a must have in my case for some of you ladies i know some of you ladies might you know change all this subject and be like oh no cool um what's it called um co-sleeping is bad or whatever. but in my case it was a must and the baby sleeps there and this is this is hard i'm not gonna put my arm or we're gonna roll over me and hubby on top of him no he's almost two months and he sleeps there and we both know that he's there and my son moves a lot trust me and when he cries he cries so there's no way we're gonna fall on top of this this is very hard so that's that well thank you guys for watching remember to give me a thumbs like if you enjoyed this video if you ladies would like 
any other types of video, baby related, mother life related, lifestyle video, please remember to leave the comment below. I will read and like the comments below. Also remember to click the subscription button below. I would love for you to join my family here in YouTube. And remember to click the notification bell that it will keep you up with my videos. Well, thank you ladies for watching. Until next time, bye ladies.